I didn't have any watercolor. So I mixed a little bit of tempera paint with a lot of water to make my watercolor. And I am going to be painting on a piece of cardboard. What are you painting on? Is anybody else painting on cardboard? No, just a piece of paper. Oh, teacher Sophia has paper. Maya, what do you have? Paper. Paper. Marnie, what do you have? Paper. Paper. Landon, what do you have? Paper? Yeah? Nice. I did not have the right kinds of paper in my house because all I had was printer paper and I'm, my mom is in her office and I just, I couldn't get it. So I got a piece of cardboard because we have had so many boxes in our house. So, do you have your salt? Did anybody bring a crayon with them or an oil pastel? Yes, Dean. I think it's all messed up. That's okay. Oh. You can still use it. Hey, guys, did anybody? One second. If you have a white crayon or a white oil pastel, you can make squiggly lines on your paper. Like, what does the ocean have? What are those things called when the ocean is moving like this? What's it called? Does anybody know? Jacob, what's it called? Oh, I can't unmute you, love. You got to do it. What's it called? And the ocean by the beach? Waves. Waves. So if you have a white or even blue or whatever color you want, crayon or oil pastel, you can make squiggly lines on your paper or on your cardboard, whatever you have, see? Like that. And that way. All right, are you ready for the painting part? Now, here's the deal, okay? We have to put the salt on the paint while it is still wet. Because what we were gonna do is the salt dries on the, on the watercolor and then it makes a really cool design. So is everybody ready with their brushes? Let me see your brushes. Nice. And your watercolor. And go for it. Start painting. This is what mine is looking like so far. See, I only have one kind of blue, but if you have lots of different blues, that's cool too. Cover the whole paper. Maybe even some green. Sometimes the oceans are green. I'm gonna add a little bit more paint to mine because I think I put too much water. And not enough paint. But you guys have watercolor, so that shouldn't be a problem. All right, once you have covered the whole paper, you can take some salt. My mom's Whoops. still getting my water. Yeah, okay, don't worry. Okay. And you can sprinkle the salt onto your paper. Uh-oh, guys, I poured too much salt into my hand and now it's gonna be wasted. And we're gonna see what it looks like when it dries. See, so this is mine right now. You can't even really see the salt, right? Did you use the white? All right. Sprinkling some salt because it's pretty cool. I wish I didn't take this much salt, but oh well. How's this everybody? How is everybody doing? Huh?